Oh, Noki Base, just a short hop, skip, and a jump away. Of course, we have to climb all the way back up to the top yet again, but... Healy Mouth's Dentist! So this is something that multiple people have encountered. This is that's not good design. Okay, Mario. Let's be not stupid. Well, I can assure you that it's, I've never had the game crash. Period. This is why you can't rush testing of software. Um. <clears throat> oh, hey! More stuff over here! Wow! Just grab the ledge! It's easy. Why do I get the feeling that if I pull up there, that those stupid invisible boxing gloves are going to pop out and be like, I hit Oh wait, this is where I'm supposed to go. Physics! Alright, let's try this yet again. There we go. Didn't crash that time. <laughs> All right. Now let's head for the dentist. Giant temple area here. So I believe there are blue coins here up high. On top of the pillars, maybe? My senses show highly toxic materials approaching. I think there are blue coins in here, like high up. Oh, they're in episode 8. <laughs> Great. That doesn't make sense, this is the same area. See, that's literally just the developers going out of their way to make the blue coins even more annoying than they already are. There's no reason for them to not appear here, because it's the same location you go to in episode 8. Alright, hey, Yili. I'm here to help. I'm just the dentist. And unlike real dentists who spend all their time poking and prodding at teeth, I'm just going to be squirting water on it for you. So he's got a bunch of teeth and we literally just use uh, the hover nozzle to... Okay. You go ahead and take a good long breath cleaned off some of your teeth. I need to get closer and clean off some of the others. It is annoying to go up in this level. Okay. Really, Ely?
Grrr. Why does he have four eyes? Man, and I thought I hated the dentist. Uh-oh. That tooth was like a beyond saving, I guess. What were you eating, bruh? All of the pollution in the lake is just coming from his teeth. That makes me feel better about my teeth. It's like, how often do you floss, Ari? It's like, I've never heard of this word floss before. Your teeth are in terrible shape. Well, at least they're not polluting a whole lake. And if they ask, like, do you know somebody whose teeth was polluting a lake? I'm gonna be, well, yeah. And then I'm gonna show them th this video. And then they'll be like, wait, you're colorful already? What? Last time I checked, eating too much candy does not make your teeth so rotten that they pollute the whole lake. Remember to take proper care of your teeth! He's like, yay! He only has four remaining teeth, and then his gold tooth turns into a Shine Sprite. How to properly take care of your teeth. Just have Mario use Hover Nozzle on them. Duh. I never realized that he leaves a heart-shaped trail of coins. I never knew to notice that before. That's that's nice. Sixty-four shines. Yes. What's the next? Oh yeah, we can do the next level. Next level's easy. Second Piantissimo Surf Swim. Also known as, if you get Turbo Nozzle, it's really easy. <laughs> there he is. Thanks to you, our bottom B is clean again. Thank you. Now, hopefully all of our people will return home again. We owe it all to you. Thanks. I say, do you know that guy? He's been waiting up there for you for a, quite a while. I can cheat it with Turbo Yeah, you can cheat it with Turbo Nozzle, absolutely. You just gotta find Turbo Nozzle first. Which, if memory serves, is hanging out at the edge of the bay somewhere. I know Turbo Nozzle's around here somewhere. It's on this level. Super promise. I also use it to help me grab some of those blue coins. Perhaps we should get a bird's eye view. Too far. Why? That wasn't there in any of the other missions. This is so dumb.
Man, how many... I must have most of the blue coins in Noki Bay. S only 17? I feel like I've picked up way more than that. Come on, draw distance. Let me see where the blue coin is at the bottom. Oh shoot, wait, no. Oh, no. Go up. Swim up! Mario, swim up! Mario, you are so bad at swimming in this game. He's like, I can go up one inch per second, and that is it. Like, how did they take Mario 64, which had great swimming, and make it so bad in this game? A game that is about water! I just, I don't understand how you can downgrade that much. Yo, yo, Jay, what's up? Mario just drowned because he's incapable of swimming in this game. We're gonna drown again getting this blue coin. Actually, no, we're not, because we can pick up the coins on the way back up. No! You jerk butt! You're trying to drown me! don't know how Mario just forgets how to swim in between Mario 64 and this. Oh boy, guys, it's everyone's favorite. It's the boat. The boat that is pretty much impossible to control. Yeah, that's what I wanted to happen. Some of these platforms have, uh, blue coins in them. If memory serves. I really don't want to get too close to that guy and trigger the fight before I can get the turbo nozzle. But I can't remember what the turbo nozzle is. Mario, please don't hit the wall, jump, and then immediately fall again. Thank you. That's what I wanted to see. Oh, that was beautiful, Mario. If we climb up high enough should be able to find it. I thought the turbo nozzle was near where the hover nozzle normally is. Okay, no trampoline today. Oh look, more boxing gloves. Yay. Okay, I know turbo nozzles on this level. I've used it on this level before. But where is it?
Maybe it's on this side somewhere. It's underneath the platform that I was standing on? Again, I don't know how much stream delay there is, so... If I picked a day to have better draw distance in a game, oh, this would be it. I'm also running a little bit low on my water supply. It's in front of the waterfall? Alright, well... Actually, can we enter the shell's secret early? If we did a precise spin jump, we might be able to. Oh, yeah, there it is. I see it. Does the trigger area for it just not exist? Come on. Come on. Why are you not wall jumping off of this? It's a flat wall! There we go. Nope, that's... That's where the ice block is. I know the turbo nozzles on this level. So that's the hover nozzle. Oh, is it under one of these crates? A crate within a crate? Forget it. I'll just do it the old-fashioned way. I swear I'm not dreaming that, though. I swear I have done this challenge with the turbo nozzle. Ah, foolish man, I am second PR Tissimo. I challenge you to a race to the flag. The key for this challenge is to not swim. It is a race to the finish. The best time is 40 seconds. Are you ready? Let's go. What do you know? The boxing glove actually came in handy. I'll be honest, I remember the challenge being a lot harder than that. I was just waiting for the turbo nozzle to be right around the corner. Whoa! You are quite speedy! You are like a fish! You may not be the slow clam chomper I took you for! May we race again? Watch for me! I don't want to race you again. Sixty-five! I think we'll do... 
I think we'll finish up the Noki Bay. We'll do Shell Secret and then the Shadow Mario one, and then we can call it a stream. I do actually like Shell Secret, so. All right, episode six, the Shell Secret. <laughs> Remember that rainbow shell that we saw? Yep, we're going in there. Because all of a sudden there are now telephone poles going all over Noki Bay. For some reason. Hey, Grandpa. Mesh Mario, you must become tied to our destiny, I'm afraid. A pathway to another world has opened above our fair land. Surely you will go there. Of course you must go. I apologize for involving you in all this. Good luck. We'll cheer you on. Alright. Where does this lead? That's pretty far away. Oh, dang, that's steep. Oh, Turbo Nozzle's on this level. Of course it is. Forget it. I'll, I can get those later. And by later, I mean not today. Those are slow moving sparks. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, oh, I almost did some crazy parkour there. I have played Tropical Freeze. That's a great game. Liked it a lot more than I thought I would. Ah, darn it. Let's just go. One for the money, two for the show. I don't think there is a hard mode for uh, Tropical Freeze. No cheat codes. Doesn't that look like fun? In all seriousness, this is one of my favorite secrets because it's actually hard for the right reasons. Most of it's figuring out, all right, how do I move forward, rather than just, oh, you gotta make these really, really precise jumps. <laughs> like up here. To get through here, you actually need to use the triple jump, which you never really need to use at any other point in the game. Oh yeah, it does have mirror mode. Well, here's the thing, those games are already really hard. Oh, I was trying to wall jump off that. It's just a pole that we can climb. Whew. All right. Yeah, this secret is really fun. It's it's more about figuring out how to do the platforming sections than actually doing them. As paradoxical as that is. It's true. I never did 100% returns or tropical freeze. Tropical freeze returns, I'm not sure if I would go back in 100%. I didn't enjoy it that much, but I definitely enjoyed tropical freeze. Really, my only real complaint with the shell secret is the fact that it is on the long side. I think it's longer than it should be. Oh. 
<sighs> yep, that's one of the few secret areas I really, really like. Very fun. Second chances? That was my first try. <laughs> I love how the easiest and first of the secrets I died like eight times on, and then like the hardest one I did first try. Hold it, Shadow Mario! Episode 7. I remember this Shadow Mario one being annoying. Yeah, there's definitely a lot of well-hidden bonuses in uh, Tropical Freeze. Is that a relative of yours? Quite an odd family you've got. What? Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh. Cut him off. Oh no, it's this stupid platform. Okay, hang on. No! It's gone! He's still doing crazy jumps, and he's left me all behind. The Piatas don't care about Shadow Mario. They care more about <laughs> forcing Mario to solve their problems for them. Another thing I would do if I improved Mario Sunshine. Improve the hit detection on Shadow Mario. What was that? That was not even close to what I told Mario to do, by the way. Oh yeah, and make the swing... Honestly, just improve a lot of the game. I also want to know why Shadow Mario makes Mario s get stunned way f for a much longer period of time than every other enemy in the game. She was at 1 HP. Curses! I won't forget this! Shine! There we go. 67 shines. And over 140 blue coins. Alright, that's gonna have to be where we finish the stream today because I don't want OBS crashing anymore, and we've made some great progress. I don't... I'm not going to say we finish everything next stream, but I don't see it taking more than two streams, because we've honestly finished most of the levels. You know what's the most and... exciting thing about winning? It's when you win. I love that feeling. Yeah. I just... <sighs> I know it's like, oh, I barely have m half the shine spreads, but remember, once we get all the blue coins, we turn those in for 24 shines. So that's just an instant 24 shines once we get that done. And, again, we only really have one or two shines left on most of the levels, so... 
Maybe next mission, ne next stream will just be a lot of blue coin hunting. I don't know, but at the very least, we'll be finishing up most of the main worlds next time. And Hollow Knight will be continuing Monday and Wednesday. Hopefully, we can finish Hollow Knight up to this week because then that'll make it a perfect even 30 stream vods. And uh, I do think that will be a nice round number to get things squared off on. So. We'll just have to see then. Thanks for watching, everybody. It was great chatting with you all. Hope you have a fantastic rest of your weekend. God bless everyone. See you later.